Okay, we have Remembrance on three. Ah, I still love this hand though. I might not even play the Remembrance. I'm gonna keep it. But I am very in love with this hand. I think I will just save Remembrance for the Lux turn. The turn after Lux, I should say. Only a fool would enter battle up with Take that. You cannot hold us down. Got Mountain Goat, so I definitely want to clear that if I can. Got Priestess. We're not going to have much mana left, unless turn 4 or 5, I guess. Feed that. Octopus eats the goat. Seems good to me. Got Priestess. Yeah, I could play Spacey and Sked, but it's not necessary. Ooh, Written the Star seems really good here. Golden Sister is really good here, too. Because uh, this is going to be kind of slow. I don't really have a way of dealing with Twisted Fate either, so the Warrior is also tempting for that reason. Wow, that's a really tough call. Uh, I think I'm going to do this just because I have no way of dealing with Twisted Fate otherwise, but... I'll feel really good if this kills Twisted Fate. I will feel like I made the right choice. It's really hard to say you made the wrong choice though with sisters and stuff though. With you're in the stars you certainly can make the wrong choice, but with sisters it's just never really a wrong one per se. So I definitely took a bit more of the unsure route. This is great, we get to get our temple. I'm excited about that. Wasn't expecting to get the temple with only taking two damage. They got a temple too, though. Yikes. Alright, we'll get rid of this dusk petal. Pretty sure it's a snake here. I mean, can you just like play Nephilios, please? Thanks. That's not an Aphilios. I'll still play this. Because I'm still gonna play it. I'm still gonna go for the use attacks. It's just such a big tempo swing for me. But I have to. It just feels too freaking good. Got some pretty celestials attacking in. Nice mess of paint. Alright, they're probably going to play in Aphilios now though, right? That's how it is. Yep. I still like her play though. We have two challengers left on the board. Um, TF does suck a little bit for us, but we can play the Pale Cascade if we feel so inclined to do so. Although I'd much prefer to get the Lux going. Another Lux, no Ophelia, so... I mean, we got part of our engine going, but we really would like to see. There it is. A red card. Uh, with this hand, uh, I don't think it's worth it. I'm a people person. They might Cali here. I just want to get my Lux down though. Once I play Remembrance, I can shoot Twisted Fate in the face. So I'm just going to be concerned about that for now. So there's the Calibrum, an expected one. I want to shoot Twisted Fate first or Philios first. Uh, since they could probably burst from hand, definitely the Twisted Fate first. Twisted Fate also wins the game more hard than Philios wins the game. Is that just for cycling reasons? 
because... Oh yeah, never mind. They hadn't attacked yet. I was thinking they had attacked, but no, they hadn't. Down to three. Okay, so we got you. Give me a challenger, please. Give me the challenger. Thank you. They use a grabby too, so they could do Aphelios' gifts from beyond. But I'm pretty happy. <laughs> After that... Pretty sure... Wait, with that, they now buff up the wrong thing. So we go for this instead. They don't buff Aphelios anymore, so he dies. So that's pretty bad for them. Pretty good for me, though. So, now I can gym here? How much should I worry about this? I don't have to worry about them yet. And they're not in PNZ. I might... You know what? should have done that first. I'm gonna think I'm just gonna do this first. They might hush this, but yeah, I'm still gonna go for this anyway. This is such a funny hand. Yeah, I should have waited on that gym though. I could have healed it. You even warned! Give it any vulnerable surround if it dies this round. Good good call. Good call. Well, they're not hushing it, at least. Feels bad that I had to do that, but I think it was the right play. And this is also really unfortunate. Why you? Ugh. Oh. This card. Bastion. Bastion's good. Oh, you find that obliterate. You get that obliterate. Crazy, isn't it? I need Aphelios, please. I need items, I need weapons, I need some cycle. Thinning out my deck with Crescendum. Okay, we're going to bolt now. Boop. No oh, wait, we can't bolt quite yet. Uh, five. It's not worth it quite yet. Uh, I like the burst pass anyway, though. I want them to go for the obliterate. Dang it. Yeah, I should have just gone for it. Whatever. I, I don't know why I just did that. Some BM or something. I can just hold on to this and pretend like it was intentional. But no, I don't know why I did that. I guess I was expecting them to develop more. Bastion. I mean, okay. That's fine. Remembrance? I guess I'll take the extra bolt. Very easy extra bolt. And a challenger. All part of the plan. <laughs> so I'll bolt the 5 3. Bolt you. Get some extra stuff going. Hmm. 
if I consider this as a suit four damage to face, I must know. Yeah, it does do four damage to face. I'm pretty sure that's worth it. Except then I can get bastioned, so it's not worth it. No more holding back. Or then I can't use bastions. What I meant to say. So I have the plus one one. I have prismatic barrier. I mean, I kind of. Um, I want to go for the bolt. I mean, I have concerted, so I don't have to go for it that way. I'll just be bolting. Actually, what we can do instead, though, we can just be like prismatic barrier here. I won't stand by. Seems like the better thing to go for. Back, heretic. Good, good. Do I even see what card they played from their invoke yet? Can't remember. I don't. Oh, this was it. I don't actually have to worry about the obliterate. Not as much. But having this in hand is still nice. Hmm. I wish I would draw my Aphilios. I mean, I think this uh, concerted here is worth it. Got that. Get another laser. Boom, ba da dum, boom. They only have three cards left. Not bad, not bad. I mean, that's annoying. Oh, they had another one. Okay, I mean, that could have been dangerous. I could have lost my lux there, but. No big deal. Bashing up again. They have same number of cards as I do. I have another bolt here if they play another elusive. So that is really good for me. Yeah, I don't really. My space is a bit dead here for that reason, but that's okay. I can even save my 5, five my 5 4 challenger now. Definitely puts me in a place where I'm kind of pressuring the game a bit more. So they got the Infernum. That's fine. Maybe they try to kill my Lux here. Which, I mean, they can try, but uh, they're gonna have to do a lot to do that. They're going to add an additional buff to it. Which, I still keep my Lux alive at one. Unless, you know, something else happens here. And I get to give her the Bastion. You go there. And you go there. And I get the additional, additional buff. For my temple. More nice. Do I want to beam this or do I want throw it away. I think we just do this, actually. It's not worth beaming that. So we take this attack here. I don't know if we do, actually. Not with this hand. It's a bit sketchy. Because the elusives they could have. But they can just develop them on their turn at this point. I want to find a messenger. Okay. That's a card that exists. Can we silence it? You know what? Crescent Strike should do it. And here's where I, my constellation. I mean, they can open attack to kill my Lux. But we can't do anything about that. <laughs> Yeah, they were open attacking to kill my Lux. 
I mean, fine. I got this Crescent Strike all excited, thinking that I would just be able to stop them in their tracks, but that's not the case. Equinox would have been so much better. Hey, we still won though. Yay! 